Hey everyone, welcome back to Automate with Amit. So today it was uh, interview day in my company. So I was part of a, a you know interview panel and I took five interviews today. And uh, it was a QA intern drive basically. So there were uh, all the candidates who have a fresher background. So they haven't have a previous uh, work uh, experience. So it was a complete fresher uh, drive. So in this video, I am going to help you understand, you know, uh, what is the uh, three skills which is very, very important to, you know, uh, to have for any fresher who is going for interview. So if you are a fresher, then this video is going to help you understand basically uh, what are the three skills which helps you to get hired in any interview. So basically, I took interview and uh, I took five interviews and uh, out of them I selected two of them and I rejected kind of uh, three uh, you know candidates so with one candidate I was completely sure that she was not uh, doing well and uh, so I have straightforward rejected her but uh, there was there were other two uh, candidates who were not that good but again I confirmed twice but uh, again uh, I was not sure so you know kind of uh, I have given another chance so maybe in round two if they perform well they will uh, move ahead if not then they will get rejected so let's talk about you know what are the thought process behind selecting those two candidates and why I rejected those three candidates so basically when whenever I take interview I see or I you know uh, go with three different things three skills basically first and foremost is learning and adapt adaptability if you are new you know uh, so um, you can be deployed to any project and you have to have that learning mindset if you don't have that learning mindset eventually what will happen you will not be able to learn and perform and the complete team will struggle so that is the main thing that is the first thing which we have to test because uh, as a candidate you have to be ready to learn new things and perform well okay uh, so it should not happen that okay uh, there are many candidates uh, so all those candidates actually were uh, from CDAC so we pick candidates from CDAC and we had screened them so we have given 45 uh, questions uh, for a screening so those questions were related to the SQL programming aptitude uh, these kind of questions and uh, there was a cutoff so if you clear that then only you go in round one which is one-on-one -on -one interview okay and the second round uh, basically once you go uh, in that what I said you if you already learned few things okay so in that case what will happen and if you are not ready to learn new things okay so it will be a problem for complete team okay so that's why it is very very important to understand and be ready for learning uh, new things and adapt second thing which is very important whenever we take interviews we always make sure that you have good technical skills so for that you know whichever interview you are going into uh, maybe that is for uh, java th that is for c sharp or testing role or maybe automation or anything you should be good with technical skills so we ask uh, some java related questions some uh, you know basic uh, understanding of object oriented programming and these kind of stuff we asked so if candidates who were you know uh, who were good with technical stuff then uh, you know we have given them another chance like I asked I went on asking next uh, next thing so the third skill which they should have and it is very important to have is uh, problem solving skill so why because if you are in any IT role okay whether it's a development or QA role then it is very very important that you understand that here 
every day you are going to face some challenges you will face some uh, new problems new uh, problem uh, new programming issues will come there are some candidates who you know who don't uh, put more efforts and they lose heart or i would say they uh, you know uh, they are very very uh, frustrated when they get stuck in any particular issues so if you are that kind of person who get frustrated in uh, very easily or you put more and more efforts and try to think and solve the problems so if you are that kind of person then eventually what will happen you are you will be you know uh, treated as a good person and uh, interviewer will be you know uh, happy with your performance because it is very important to understand why problem solving is very important because as i said every day you will face some challenges so if you know things if you are even if you don't know then also you should be uh, willing to put more efforts and then resolve the problems okay so that was all in this video i hope uh, if you are uh, you know you are going to go in any new interview or uh, if you have already faced or attended any interview and you also felt that this kind of uh, skill were asked to you then uh, do let me know in the comment box and if you are new okay make sure you are also inhibiting or you are showcasing these is skills because these are very very important okay so with that uh, see you in the next one and if you like this video please make sure to like and if you are new to the channel please make sure to subscribe and thank you for your all the love and support thank you